Hey, what's going on guys? It's Alan from Launcher Studios coming to you with another tutorial. Now, in this particular tutorial, we're going to compare two really popular softwares. These two applications are DaVinci Resolve and Adobe Premiere Pro. So now when we say we're comparing these software, we're not comparing feature for feature. We're just taking a look at the new color matching feature in Adobe Premiere Pro versus the already existing color matching feature in DaVinci Resolve. Okay, so now get let's get to this video here. So right now, as you can see, we're in DaVinci Resolve. If we wanted to do some color matching in DaVinci Resolve, what I would normally do is I would just middle mouse click on the source clip. And right away, it will copy the grades over. All I did was create some nodes so you can see that it does actually copy over the nodes. Let's undo that real quick. So if we say we had something applied to these nodes, some kind of grading, let's uh, do some crazy stuff here. Um, do some crazy stuff there. Just so you can see that it actually does something with the nodes. Um, I'm just going to come over here. I'm going to middle mouse click on this and see. It copied the nodes along, along with the grading over to this clip here. All right, so I'm going to do undo all of that. Now, the color matching comes in, I think, is when you're trying to match a clip from a different scene to a clip from a particular scene where you just want something similar. At least you want a baseline to work from. So another way of doing what we just did is if we wanted to just quickly copy over the grades, grab a still. Uh, let me grab a still from this guy here. All we had to do the same thing, the middle mouse click, and it will copy over the grade just like that. Okay, remember now, this you didn't see a change because nothing was added to any of these nodes. So I just created these nodes just so you see that a copy of the nodes. So if there were any grades applied to these nodes, then you would see a change with our subject here. Okay, so now we want to actually copy the grade here to this guy. All right, so first two ways we did it, just basically copy the nodes and whatever grades that we have applied to the, to the nodes. So in this case, we didn't have anything applied to the, to the nodes, so it just copied the nodes. And this clip here looked just the same as it did before, but with two new nodes, okay? So let me undo that. And now if we wanted to match now, this is where we would select the uh, source clip, click on the clip that we wanted to match to, go back to the source clip, right click on that, and then come down to shot match. To this clip all right so now it's not copying it's actually matching okay so a scenario where you would do matching instead of just copying is say it's from a different scene um we have a, a clip from a different scene but in the same video say we're doing music video and like i am in this case and we we got some scenes from a different location but we want to keep the same consistent look throughout the music video and so we would want to match because if we apply the same grading from that from the other clip, then it might not respond the same way as the other clip because of lighting conditions and, and we might have shot it with a different camera sometimes. So it might not respond the same way. So in this case, we would have to do some matching, not just copying the grades, okay? Hopefully that made sense. So let's switch over to Premiere Pro really quick. So we're not gonna take a look at the how necessarily. We're gonna take a, take a look at just the results. So we did the matching in Premiere Pro. This is what Premiere Pro determined was a close match to this clip on the left, okay? So now let's do the same comparison in DaVinci so we can have them side by side. In order to do that, we just have to select both of these guys and then come up to the split screen, click on that split screen icon, and then we have the same comparison view just like uh, Adobe Premiere Pro. And we can um, enlarge the screen. Let's go back to Premiere Pro and then let's, let's enlarge the screen as well. DaVinci obviously did a, a better job at matching because DaVinci also seems to match the uh, contrast as well, not just give you a similar look or a similar grade. So you guys can see that going back and forth. This is the DaVinci and this is the Adobe Premiere Pro. So in conclusion, just by looking at these really quick samples, I would say that uh, uh, DaVinci Resolve did a much better job at matching than Premiere Pro. In addition to getting this split screen here in DaVinci Resolve, DaVinci Resolve also um, give you a dual um, scope. So yeah, um, if you guys have Premiere Pro, you can download DaVinci Resolve for free and and do the same comparison and determine for yourself um, which one you think is best. That's it for this review, guys. Hopefully you found this useful. If you did, go ahead and drop me a like and subscribe to the channel. Help me to build this thing up. 
so I can produce more videos. And obviously you know that the more you produce these videos, the better the quality will get. So thanks guys for watching. Appreciate it. Take care.